Okay, um, so today I'm going to do some uh, stuff with Sprout, some vet work. Um, so the end goal was to get him ready for a blood withdrawal, a voluntary one. Um, as you can see, he's, he's fixated on the streets at the moment. Um, so what we're going to do, we're going to ask him for a hold, and then he's going to do that, and then I'm going to start doing stuff with his leg. And if he carries on with his nose on my hand, um, then we're going to carry on with the stuff. If he takes it away for whatever reason, then we're going to stop. So he chooses that when he wants stuff to stop, it stops. Yes. Um, so then when he's with the vets, he gets to choose when he's comfortable with them touching him and when he's really not. So it works really well. So in the dog, so it's a bit like the bucket game. Um, so you can do it with the bucket game as well, or you can do it with hand touch. I do it with hand touch with, with Sprout, and then uh, my mum does it differently with uh, some of my other dogs. He gets frustrated really easily. It's a Spanish thing. Um, so yeah, let's get on with it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to ask him for a hold, and then I'm going to... Move my hand here, and then I'm going to try and lift. Yes. And I'm not going to do much at all. So it's not even much of a lift. It's just like a little touch. And then if he carries on, yes. Hold. Yes. So I'm hardly actually moving at the moment. But the end goal is to pull it out, and then you get the cotton wool. We'll do that, and then you inject it. So you like what the vets would do. Hold. Yes. Um, and this is his first time doing it, um, so he may actually take his, his hand, his nose away from my hand and that's cool. Hold. Yes, good boy, good boy. So he's going to get a bigger reward for that because I actually raised it then. Good boy. You ready? Hold. Wrong way. Yes, good boy. Good boy. So the next stage what I'm going to try and do now, I'm, instead of lifting it, I'm going to try and pull it towards me. Hold. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. Ready? Hold. Okay. So you see there, he took his nose away from my hand so everything stops. Hold. Yes. Good boy. So to me, I really think it's really important when you're doing stuff like this that the dog has a choice. Rather than me not doing anything like this and just putting his paw up and then doing all this and injecting it straight away, then he's going to be really stressed and whatever. He, he may not feel 100% comfortable with me actually when he's doing the touch and me actually lifting it, but he, he, he knows he has a choice to take his hand away if he wants to. Ready? Hold. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. Ready? Do a couple more. Give me some time there. Good boy. So we'll just wait for him to look back at me and then we'll carry on. So there's no point in me. Good boy. Hold. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. So I'm actually going to end up on that one because uh, that was really good and I actually managed to put it quite a way towards me. Um, so if you want, I will do another video of me doing the next stage, which will be the wet cotton wool bud. Um, and that will be me raising it and making it wet um, and sort of numbing it ready for this. So yeah, I sort of hope that's what made sense. And if you want another one, let me know and I'll do another one. Thank you.